Quick question. Where should you direct your tithe if you're frustrated with your church? Martha was struggling with this same question while disagreeing with her church on many issues. If you, like Martha, are not sure about what to do with your tithe when situations like these occur, come back in time with me to hear what King David has to say about it. The psalmist once said, Offer to God thanksgiving and pay your vows to the Most High. Psalms 50 verse 14. He also says, I will go into your house with burnt offerings. I will pay you my vows. Psalm 66 verse 13. Okay, so when David states, pay your vows to the Most High, he is making it very clear that this is something between you and God. It's an act of worship, so your tithe should never be used as a method of evaluation for your church's performance. In the second verse, when David says, I will go into your house with burnt offerings, he is showing the specific place where our tithe should go, to the storehouse, which we already learned about in Deuteronomy 12, 2 Chronicles 31, Nehemiah 10, 12 and 13, and Malachi 3, verses 8 through 10. In the Seventh-day Adventist Church, your local church is an outpost of the storehouse, which is the conference. And God is the one who determines how the tithe should be used, so it's equally distributed to support the authorized gospel ministry around the world. As you return your time, ask the Lord to protect you from the manipulation of human feelings and to give you the right motivation as you participate in this act of worship. May we put our desires last and God first.